This is uh, the cam where uh, the displaced brothers and sisters, my people, live. So there are about 600 people here, and this is where they, you know, that's how they cook the food. And here is Sister Boy uh, Nagenipi. Vangai Kim. Here is a sister called Vangai Kim, and she is putting the fire and she is going to prepare something for them to eat. If you know what I'm say, toss it. So she wants to make something out of this bread and so that she can serve people. And this is the bread. Okay, and then, yeah, also there's something that we she already prepared, and here they have salt chili and some of the things that which they want to prepare for. And here are, you know, the plates and the cups. And the living condition here is not hygienic. And because a lot of people are living here and no proper sanitation. And then some children, they go to school and these are some bags of the school and children who go to school, the books and you see the Bibles and then their clothes, their belongings and everything is just here. And then you will see that the children, the child, and this brother is feeding, this boy is feeding this younger brother. What is boy Namini Piha? Nanao Mini Piha. Lal Kotang. His name is Lal Kotang. And he is feeding food to the child. So, I mean, uh, it's a very, very painful to see that uh, brothers and sisters in Christ are living. Uh, it's not their choice. It's not their choice. It is. A kind of genocide, and it is apartheid, and it is kind of atrocities committed towards them. And you know, they, they are innocents. They didn't do anything. They didn't deserve to be like this. But uh, the Missourians uh, discriminate, suppress them, and we have been oppressed for the last 70 years. And this is the worst uh, time that we have gone through. And my people are uh, vulnerable and they need help, they need prayer support. Continue to pray for them and thank you.